Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Fury. Let's play some Vagante. If you know what this game is, you know how amazing it is. You know how underrated it is. If you don't know what this game is, it's a roguelite platformer that has been around in full release since 2018, but this game has up to four player co-op as well. Amazing. We're going to play as a wildling, first of all. Kendrick. King Kendrick, the wildling. We're going to be... Uh, Skull guy right here. King Kendrick, the Mimic Whisperer. This is the story of King Kendrick, the Mimic Whisperer. Let's just go. Yeah, it's just like, I've been addicted to this game lately. It came out on all consoles uh, a couple weeks ago, and some more people have been playing it. I started playing it because thank you very much to Blitworks, who sent me this really cool press kit with a t-shirt and like in a nice box, a magnet, a couple pins, really awesome stuff. And I played this when it came out, but I kind of like, you know, it just fell out of the rotation pretty much. And uh, it deserves, I'm playing it now on the main channel because this game's amazing. It is amazing. If you're a fan of Noita, if you're a fan of Spelunky, this game is basically what Spelunky would have been if Spelunky was way more of a roguelike, more inspired by the original rogue, because it has unidentified items and cursed items in it as well. Still very hardcore. Let's see what the merchant has. Magnificent beard, Basilard. Pale damaged ring. Okay, we're going to get that ring. Only have four gold, you're, you're saying? Don't worry about that. Let's go over here first. Don't you worry about my money. My finances. I'm a king. I'm a kingly king of the Mimics. The Mimic clan. Can you please... You know what? I don't care. Hit me. It's fine. Didn't hit me. Uh, we got the boss right here already. Baby dragon. And don't touch spikes or don't step on spikes. This game's hardcore. It's pretty hardcore. It's filled with tons and tons of... Uh, here, you can do this, though. Just don't land on them. And hey, here's... Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that cute little face. There, you know what we're going to do right now? Um, We're going to go up here. I'm going to go pay that merchant a visit for inflating his prices so much. Can you please? I gotta go this way. Or, I mean, you gotta go this way, too. Hey. There you go. Come on. Come on. And no. All right. No. Come on. No. You know what? Fine. Hey, what's up? Come over here. You're just not happy? I'm not happy either. Because your prices are outrageous. I got something to show you over here. It's totally not a mimic that is going to kill you. Or you're gonna kill? It's fine. Maybe you'll fall on spikes like you just did. What a smart, very shrewd businessman you are. Now, gold collector, good. We got like gold magnet. Um. So this is. Let me just kill this. Oh, uh, there's a behind it with a tan scroll. Let's use the scrolls, maybe. Unless it wants me to do that. Um, uncurse? Okay. Alright, never mind. So we know what uncurses look like now. We have identified those. Hello, rat. Alright, I guess that's it. Well, here. We want to first trigger that and then trigger that one, and then wake you up, Esmeralda. Doesn't that look like an Esmeralda? Toothy smile. Here, kill. Come on, Elmer. Get him. Get that nasty baby dragon that, aw, oh, man. All right, the dragon killed my child. Grab that. All right, all right, hang on, hang on. All right, take out the goblin, please. Thank you. And now. Come here, dragon. Here, take that. This time, 
look at look how happy he looks. My baby. Stop trying to kill my baby. Ugh. That's what you get, punk. Alright, let me maybe equip a weapon. What is this? Oops. Alright. You killed poor Howard. Alright, hang on, hang on. I didn't see if there was any water around. We can be if we were in a pool of water, this dragon wouldn't even hit us. Because it just breathes fire. Alright, let's just take a little bit of time here. To just whack you right in the face and kill you. Now. Is there a... Uh... Nope. I think that was the hole. Did we get a... We got a book. Luminous. That's fine. Gotta open the chest. Forgot how to play. Odinars. Did we just get a legendary? Hang on. Do not drink potions until you identify them. Look at this. Fire jump. Yes. 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 That's huge. Okay. This weapon sucks, though. Um, just don't jump on the spikes. Instant death. Look at that. We can use this to kill bosses in a pinch that might be too tough for us. There are a couple. Depending on our, you know, yeah, depending on our build. Uh, defense, fire resist. Luminous, one defense. Vitality, cold resist. Let's unequip that. Put this one on, we got fire resist. Yeah. This one just gives us a little bit of luminosity, a little bit of light. No big deal. Alright, let's go. Max health. Um, is there anything to eat? Oh hey. <laughs> Free rat for everyone. Where was the exit? Oh, it's behind this. Okay. Uh, let's go. First floor complete. First, yeah, floor, I guess. Cooked rat. That's one of the mechanics the game doesn't tell you about. We're gonna go berserk. This class is really fun. We're gonna go full berserk. Level three berserk gives us lifesteal, which is very nice. Full berserk, full fist weapon. Also mimics all over the place. Whoops, I didn't look at this. Eh, we don't want that. Shocking. Actually, yeah, we're gonna use that as our weapon. This, I don't care about. Alright, let's go. Onward. Dark Cave, level 2. So we got a shocking weapon. And fireball jumps. We What we need is a Cestus or a... Hey, hey, hey. Cestus or a um, claw. That's what we're going to eventually really want. Hopefully we find one pretty early. That would be nice if we did. Uh, must use you to trigger the trap. I'm sorry, my child. I guess that's not a breakable wall. You got to be careful. There's fall damage also. But you definitely want to not jump onto spikes because they're instant death. Same thing with uh, boulder traps. They will smush your face right in. Oh, hey. We got another uh, merchant over here. Let me just see if... Ah, you punk! Alright. We need to go up here. Need to toss you over there. Need to pick you up. Whoops. I want to use this thing, this Iron Maiden looking thing soon. Oh no, you're killing my friend! No! Cut it out! Come on, kill him. Get him. Get that. That's right. You're a good mimic. Look at you. So cute. This game does have what I consider, what I think to be the cutest mimics in any game ever. I mean, come here. Look at him. Look at that little face. Little cyclops, little horns, toothy smile. So cute. We got a bunch of weapons now, and I guess I'm just going to equip things. Plus one strength. All right. Life steal coated with poison. Negative strength. Splash attack. Yours vestige. All right, we'll use yours vestige for now. Maybe that splash attack is pretty nice. Um, what is this? We'll wait until we need to identify things. 
actually, without just equipping them. All right. Get him. I just, I love the mimics in this game. Love them so much. All right, we're good. You did not get crushed. And the boss, I think, is right down here. Yes. Oh my god, whoops! I'm sorry! <laughs> I just threw him right down onto the spikes. There's That's a very bad, very, very bad spot to fight this boss. Like, okay, break all the spikes, please. Because I don't want to fight you anywhere near these spikes. Also... Ah, oh, my my child. Here, can I drop this on your stupid base? Yes. Because he can th he picks you up and throws you. Oh, not anymore. He doesn't pick anyone up ever again. Um, and he could throw you right onto the spikes and goodbye run, instant death. Defense, speed, and fire resist. Okay. Defense, speed, fire resist. Wait. Ah! I want that equipped. Defense, fire resist. It doesn't have speed, but it has increased chance of finding magic items, so whatever. I'll equip that one. And these gauntlets. What? Ex we got another legendary? Holy crap. Yes. Okay. Sounds good to me. Now, don't jump on spikes. Here, you know what? Oops, I missed. <laughs> oh! Don't do what he did. Ow. Then immediately I do the same thing. Alright, I'm not gonna go up there. There's probably nothing up there. There might be wall meat. Like there's a... Here, let's just do this. Jump on top of you and just set you on fire. You could break some walls very they're hard to find like one wall in each area i think has a pork chop in it and it heals you 40 hp which is real nice he's gonna shoot me right in the head i'm sure nope okay real real nice so this is gonna be a mini series we're gonna do one run hopefully hopefully get through this so far it's oops <laughs> So far, it's pretty good. It's we're getting some nice things. A lot of rings. A lot of rings, actually, but, you know. It's fine. Look at this. See hidden enemies. Strength, dex, intelligence, plus two luck, plus one defense. Yeah, this can go away. We're going to equip that. Lots of legendaries. That's insanity. Let's use some of these. Magic mapping. Jump. Um, all right. It's a waste. This, uh, let's uh, see if this is an identify. It's enchant. Okay. What about this? That's recharge. Okay, never mind. We just wasted all of them, but it's okay. It's still early enough in the run that, well, if we're going to waste scrolls, it's a good time to do it early, I guess. Oh, look at this. We don't know what this does. Um, is that an identify? Yes. Potion of poison resistance. Permanent buff. Likewise, if you drink a potion and it is uh reduce, there are there that's why you don't want to just random randomly drink potions without knowing what they do. Because you could end up just permanently reducing one of your stats. And you do not want that. You know, permanent reduction to strength or something is bad. Real bad. Don't want that. Especially for this class. Boom. Um. I mean, we don't need to find the wall meat. There we go. But it would be nice because I am about to... take a bunch of damage by uh, permanently... Oh, hey. Forgot we didn't find you already. Here's a fairy. The fairy will stay right there for now. And, uh... Okay. You're already dead. 
permanently increase the heal you get from the uh, campfire between levels. All right. So you want to rescue the fairies, although I guess that's it. All right. No more chests. We're going to do this. Skill. That was a dex one. One more, one more time. Strength. Okay. So we got permanent dexterity and strength stat increases there. Now we just need, uh, I guess I'm going to eat this rat. Yeah, it healed me a little bit. Um, let's, whoops, kill you. All right. Let's grab the fairy. And I think that was it for this area. If I can grab the eye bat. Thank you. Let me just make sure. Uh, nothing up there. Nothing down there. We got this. Whoops. Goodbye, eye bat. We don't need you. Doesn't heal you, I don't think. It just gives you, like, slightly more vision. All right. So we're going to wait for you. Although, if you do sit down at the campfire before she buffs it, it doesn't matter. You could just get up and sit down again to get that extra five heal that we just got. Level two berserk. And... Um, what are we at? 83. 130 max health already. That's crazy. I'm gonna roast some books. Because, why not? Keep that one, though. Keep that scroll. Alright, let's go. Onward. That's, yeah, throwing books and scrolls on the fire heals you in this game. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Of course, it doesn't tell you that at all. Now... Don't want to fight the boss yet. That's It's like the Eater of Worlds. Poisons the hell out of you. Coming back over here. I killed one of its babies. We might end up fighting it. Yeah, that's fine. Let me see if I can find a mimic to murder it real quick. I'm going to kill another one of your babies. How do you like that? We could just have it following us around a little bit. Maybe. Wait. There you go. Good job. Good job. Thank you. I need... Uh, whoops. Uh. A mimic, please. A chest. Although we could probably just jump up and down and burn this thing to death. Oh. But it's... Is this lightning? Yeah, shocking. It's... Uh, this boss is weak to lightning, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. I'm not, like, super uh, experienced with this game, but... I have been playing it a lot lately. I've been very addicted to it. That doesn't open. Where are all the chests, man? No, 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 no. There's one. All right. Whoops. Hang on. Here. Ow, punk. Get off my head. Oh, God. Come here. Poisoned. It's, I mean, we have tons of HP. It's okay. Just kill all these things, please. You hurt my baby. Where's the boss? There he is. No, are you gonna come over here someplace? Come on. Here, kill the, the baby. Maggot. Little maggot. Come on. Please. <laughs> Yeah, and because we're not using gold to buy anything. Hey, don't hurt my baby. All right. We can just heal with this if we need to. Spend money at that fountain to heal. All right. There's the boss. Come here. Come here, please. I have to speak with you. All right. Look at this. We're just going to wreck it. We're berserk, too, so... That's this class. We're going to go full Berserk, full Fist Weapon, and just do insane amounts of DPS. If I can get the boss to come over here, it knows. It's like, oh, you're going to totally destroy me. It's almost dead already. Come on. 
There you go. There, we killed it. It's dead. Now it's just gonna pop its ugly face up someplace and then draw me a, a treasure key. Please. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Now, oh, there was another one right here. Here, let's, uh... Go over here. Got a fuel draft. Come on. Ugh. Get. Fine. Go this way. Kill those slimes. Or that one slime. Aha. That's the one problem is the mimics are so cute and they're my children. But unfortunately, at one point or another, when raising mimic babies. Oh no, we can't get them out of here. Oh, no. At one point or another, you have to... No! Identify. Let's identify this. Featherfall. Okay. I don't know if we're going to be able to get them out of there. That's the one drawback to this... Uh, using mimics like this. Because it's amazing. They're really powerful. But... Um, all chests become mimics, and so you don't get any loot unless you... Sacrifices must be made. <laughs> Ow, that hurt. I deserve it, though. Here. Po Wand of Healing. I said potion. Wand of Healing. Very nice. Very nice find. Alright, we got all of these tinctures and potions and such. Scroll of Jump, which is good in combination with that Feather Fall. Uh, this Envenomed. We don't want that. We gotta trade in some of these items here. Alright. I think that's it. There's no item over there. Yeah, I wish I didn't bring that other Mimic all the way down there, because... It's in a bad spot. Both of those mimics now down there. And here's... Oh, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna bring you down there. If you... Unless you... Kill yourself in another way. Can you... Come on. Follow me, please. I need you to come this way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did I just... Alright, well, you're gonna die, I guess. I think I... Potentially... Oh, no, we could have jumped down this side. I didn't notice that that connected. Like, what if we... I mean, the exit is in here. We didn't softlock ourselves. And we have a claw. Masterwork claw. Please. Oh, please. Damage to gold. Negative one luck. But damage to gold is incredible. And now... Get rid of this. We have our weapon that we're going to use for the rest of the run, probably. Or at least for a while. We need to enchant it, though, to kind of try to uh, improve things. Oh, reflects projectiles now. We get, we're getting a lot of rings. Damage to gold is huge, though. Especially there's another enchantment we can get. Where, because uh, you could just attack everything and get gold from it. Where gold will heal us. And that'll be nice to have. You just go around just hitting everything with this weapon and healing from it all. Um, magic mapping. All right. I think 58 HP or mimics over there. We got to kill you. How did you get over here? How did I not kill that enemy? Don't know. I'm not going to worry about uh, picking up the eye bat corpse. But we are going to, since we're not using any gold, just heal here a little bit. Oh, thanks for the one heal. All right, two. It's amazing. Right, that was a good one. Pen, all right, we'll keep it like that. 
Um, unfortunately, I don't think I can do anything now with these. Oh, you know what? I lie. We can get at least one of you out. There we go. What? No! Never mind. That sucks. Never mind. Okay, I was able to do it. Um, well, since I got one out, that means I'll get the other one out. Hang on. Throw you that way. And then I can't... I could push this. Never mind. That. Throw you over here. I'm so sorry. It's That's why. The game's like, you're just gonna murder them. Let's see what this is. Heavy punches. That means we're gonna do a lot more damage. Dude, what's going on? With our claw attack now. Heavy punches. Excellent. Excellent. Let's go and kill the other mimic. All right, come here. Okay, we got you. Gotcha. Cool. You just gotta get a get. Gotta get good at throwing things. I'm so sorry. No, come back here. Like no, stop it. Another wand. Ice wand. All right. And here we'll take you. Oh, where's the fairy? Oh no, we already did that. That was last level fury. All right, let's get out of here. Okay. Now, we cook you, get this eyeball, and just like that, now we can heal by slashing at them with our claw when we go berserk. Sweet. That's amazing. We have heavy punches already. This, it doesn't have, I mean, it's damage to gold, which is really nice. Negative luck, whatever. But we need enchanting scrolls, hopefully, to uh, improve that. Yeah, and identification scrolls, so we can start identifying all these other potions, so we could drink them, maybe. Anyway, guys, all right, I'm going to try to get these out daily until we hopefully get through this entire run and get a nice victory. Anyway, all right, see you next time. Have a great day. Peace.